Hey everybody, my name is Das, and welcome back to Stone of Life. Uh, I'm really, really enjoying this game, and uh, this is episode 3, so if you guys haven't watched it yet, go back and watch the first two episodes, and let's get right into it. So this is where we left off, but before we do anything, um, my damage was kind of lacking last episode, and I was taking a lot of damage. So I'm going to go to our level up screen and see what I can do. I think I need some uh, new equipment, like a new weapon. Okay, just as I thought. Since I've leveled up some, I can actually use Warhammers now. So this great sword that I have has an attack of 77-82. I'm not really sure what that means, but we're just going to go by those numbers. So this is the rogue warhammer which is an epic weapon which is pretty awesome to already have this early in the game um, and it has 105-118 plus damage undead percentage 58 I'm not really sure what that means but let's see what the other one is this is just a rare warhammer and it's not as strong so we're gonna use the uh, rogue warhammer which is epic I actually don't know how to I'm not sure how to socket or anything like that. Or maybe you can't actually socket. I don't know. Ah, uh, Firebolt must be my special attack, which we have not used yet. We'll get into that more. I haven't really paid enough attention to my special attacks. Uh, is there any other armor that I can use? No, that's just the one with six defense, which for some reason I said seven last episode. <laughs> nothing, nothing, nothing. Okay, well, at least we increased our attack by a lot, so that's pretty good. Uh, and now our dude walks around with the Warhammer. It looks pretty cool. I'm just going to save that. And let's continue on. Uh, our quest mentioned that we needed to go north. So, okay, we're at the outskirts of the Canis Forest. So, I'm going to save again because the save is really freaking fast. And then we are going to move deeper into the forest. So, I'm not really sure where to go. Actually, I have no idea. Ah, this must be it. Power attack. No, we're about to figure that out. Okay. These guys have really good defense. But they also give a lot of experience if you kill them, so... Okay, I got some items and some gold. I'm not sure which way to go. That was awesome. I have to be really careful and dodge a lot because I absolutely cannot afford to be hit. That was awesome. It's kind of good to, to let them group up because you'll do so much damage. That was awesome. I got some boots. Which I'm sure are much better than what I have on. Okay, let's try not to get hit by this guy. For this to be my strongest weapon, I'm not killing them as quickly as I thought I would. Okay, we got a water rune. I still don't know how to use runes. Okay, let's go ahead and try my special attack. Nice. Firebolt skill book. I guess what I just used was firebolt, so... I also have a special melee attack saved up, but of course I saved that for any bosses. Some boots. We are getting so many items now. It's freaking awesome. Oh, come on. Oh, well. What's in the chest? 
Oh, we got some healing potions, which is great because um, before I started this episode, I actually had to use one. But where do we go? Sometimes I get kind of confused. Okay, so this way. Oh. That was awesome. But my dude is hurting, so I've got to be careful. I, mean, I got a helmet. That's awesome. Oh my god, my dude is hurting. I'm not going to be an idiot. I'm going to heal. <laughs> so we, we're down to four health potions. And as you can see, there's a bit of a, like a recharge time or like a waiting period before you can use another one. So you have to be cautious of that. Gold room. These guys have some reach. You really have to take the reach of the weapons into consideration on this game. You don't have to be quite as close to them as you think. Wow, I got a battle axe. It's pretty sick. Uh, I don't know what that thing is. But apparently I can destroy it. Oh, and apparently it fights back. I'm taking so much damage. Oh. Use the Resurrection Stone. No, I don't want to use any items. I tried to tap my healing potion in time, but I guess I didn't. So we have to restart that area. Dang. This game is getting pretty difficult, actually, fairly soon in the game. I think I need to stop being so conservative with the special attack. I really think that that's a thing. That special melee attack I build up, I don't use it. I save it for bosses, and that messes me up. I should have used it on that defense tower. Alright, let's try this again. I know I was pretty close to the end of it. I bet my prize, or that spirit, was probably uh, behind the defense tower. Okay, I guess the good part is that, you know, I don't know for sure if the experience and the gold and stuff actually stacks, but we're going to earn all this experience and gold again. Yeah, it does stack. That's one pretty cool thing, actually. Even if you fail, you keep all your experience and items, so that's, that's pretty nice. I'm getting so many items. getting all this gold because I know later on we're going to have to buy some better equipment. I know that my weak point is my defense. I know that my armor sucks and my weapon is better than my armor. So we really need to work on armor after this. Our next thing needs to be armor. See how easily my guy gets so badly hurt? Let's go ahead and heal. Now, I know that the blue bar under my health bar has to be something to do with magic or something like that, so we're going to see what's up with that. I'm going to keep my distance. I'm not getting hit again. If I can help it. I'm going to let him keep walking into it. Awesome. Sure enough, there was gold. Okay, so special melee attack, I think. I'm not sure if I want to use it. Let's use this attack. 
You know what? I'm not dying. Wow, that gave us so much experience. We are leveling up so much. That's awesome. We are level 9 now. Alright. Let's see what was behind this defense tower. Dungeon of Ancient Spirit 3. We've got to be getting close. Ugh, this feeling. It's just like when I destroyed the fragment of the Stone of Life. There must be a spirit this way. Oh, so our dude can feel when a spirit is near. Because of what happened to him. Oh my god, is that the boss? This sucks. This freaking sucks. This freaking sucks. This sucks. Oh my god. I have to hope and pray that my special melee attack builds up. Look at how much damage he's doing. We've got to heal again. This dude is taking like next to no damage. Alright. We are going to bob in, hit, and then pull out. To be honest, I wish that our fire attack did more. Oh my god. This is insane. Finally. It did not kill him. We are out of healing potions. So we have to play perfectly. Oh my god, we are hurting so bad. Ah, oh, I couldn't move. Oh my gosh. I'm failing so hard. Are you kidding me? Alright, let's go ahead and work on our equipment. That's what we've got to do. Yeah, we'll, we'll go with that. We'll go with that. Oh, that's sick. So we can increase our health. Defense, nine. Alright, so, I mean, it's not the best thing in the world, but we are in better shape now. Oh, you can't use a shield with a warhammer, so we can't have that shield. That's okay. We have better armor now. I'm actually going to have to end this episode without beating this level. Uh, what we're going to do now is we're going to go to that um, woman who sells uh, potions, and we're going to rack up on potions. 2,000. We're going to buy 10 of these. And we are going to save it. And then we are going to reattempt this on the next episode. I'm really sorry that I couldn't progress, but at least we got leveled up. At least we got new equipment. At least we're getting the hang of things. So like if you enjoyed this video. Subscribe to see more from me in the future. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. Take care.